Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm uh, cooking a cauliflower with pork. It's already been diced. These are the pork that you know I portioned them. First, we'll cut the onion. If you don't have this kind of onion, you can do the green one. So my knife is sharp. Flour. You can add anything, different. You know, one thing with this onion, it's always sting my eye. The cauliflower, I cut it already earlier, so here you go. It's white. It's it's not potato. It's a cauliflower. There's our frying pan. I put some cooking oil already. So now just kind of drop the onion there. want to wait till it burns the onion, we'll put our meat. Okay, if you don't have pork, you can use chicken. This is a pork. We'll wait for that one to tenderize. Uh, right now, I'm going to put the uh, oven to low. And we'll put a lid for that one and cook it up. It's very quick to cook it. Okay, let's check it out how this will be. Uh, be sure the meat is cooked for you. Yeah, it's still not cooked. It's gonna get more longer time. Uh, for our spices, uh, I have this one. It's uh, garlic and ginger mint. Mint so it's already you know grounded up in the jar, so we'll use that one. I use a cayenne for a tang. You know you wanna spice it a little bit, but uh, you know get a kick so I use put some tank put some cayenne okay? then our vegetable broth okay if you don't have vegetable broth then just use salt and pepper it's a normal you know uh, spices seasoning for your food that's it okay we're adding up our spices here start with this cayenne not too much or else I will not be able to eat the food then let's get this garlic and ginger mint. It's already been. It's a paste, now you know. And also our vegetable broth. It's a powder. Now you don't need salt and pepper. Maybe we'll cover it up and simmer it again. Another 20 minutes. But the video is not 20 minutes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's check it out. What's going on with our meat? I can smell it. It's good. Tasty. Oh. Yeah, but it still needs uh, the meat, the pork has to be tender, right? Eh? has to cook it properly because you don't want to get a food poisoning. Yeah. Another couple of minutes. Come back later. I think it's 
bowl. The meat. Now we'll add our cauliflower. Whoa. There we go. Now let's cover it up and check it later. Our cauliflower is looking good. Which means it's almost cooked. Now for me being diabetic, I don't need uh, rice. So the cauliflower is uh, carb. So that's it. Just eat this by itself. But if you want some rice, uh, sure, why not? But for me, this is just right. No rice. But I think it needs more cooking more. Five more minutes. Okay, get this thing done, I think. I think the broccoli, not broccoli, oh my goodness. Broccoli is green, this is cauliflower. And it looks so done. Now you don't want to overcook it, like it's going to be turned into a mash. Some people use cauliflower as a mash potato, using it to mash. So we'll do a plate for our... I didn't taste it up. Maybe just sauce. Very good. Oh, I can taste the cayenne. Oh. In I So there's our plate. That would be for lunch. Thanks everyone for watching. Please subscribe and likes. Adios.